Hi folks and welcome back to part 2 of my big block of vlog um, I hope you're all well um, So I'm at, like, currently at the back of the Hounsville shopping centre Which as you all know is one of my favourite shopping centres here in Blackpool So this is where they load up, you know, where they get all the deliveries from Deliveries to rather so, um, I remember all this when it was sort of all flat ground and they were just starting to build it um, some hotels across the road there as well. So what I thought I'd do in this video, just take a take a walk across, you know, through town centre. Wait for these cars to pass because it's noisy. Uh, walk through town centre, um, you know, around St John's Square, and then I'm gonna go get myself a um, Mackey's hot, uh, McDonald's hot chocolate as well, and go into the town festival headland for a bit before actually. It's all right. Um, if I'm actually going home, God, you see a lot of these people on um, e-scooters and stuff at the moment. I think I think they are quite popular. <laughs> never seen a never seen a middle-aged woman on one before. That's new. That's very very new. But yeah, there's another a bit of a wander around. I did actually go and get my new dwarf hamster today. He's currently sat in, but I'm gonna do a separate video on that. Crikey, my horses. First tattoo place here. And get all the bars and stuff here. Full fact, my uh, my uncle actually lives around here. And um, I don't know if he still does or if he's if he's moved or not. But um Yeah. I think I think I'm actually still going on with this extension. Not sure how, because the last time I was here, um, it was sort of like an hour trip, so I'm not sure how much of it they've actually completed. Let's wait for the truck to pass. Okay, here's here's one for all you history buffs out there. Who remembers when the Doctor Who shop was here? It was, it was called the Who. I'm not sure whether it was in this building here. I think it was in this building, the Who shop. Um, I remember going in there a couple of times with my mum. To have a look at all the Doctor Who figures and stuff like that. Um, I'm not sure what that building was. If you know what it was, comment down below. But I think that that this one was definitely the Who shop. Um, when we used to get, where I used to get all my Doctor Who stuff. Because I did used to be a bit of a Doctor Who fan. Um, I have started watching Doctor Who again. Because, you know, why not? Here is the back of the Olympia. Yes. Olympia. Oh, I've gone the wrong way. What am I doing? Come on, Peter. Get it together. Um, what's it done? I don't think much, much, they've done much, much change. It still looks very, vaguely the same. Um, well, they've got all the stairs and stuff in there. Because uh, as you know, Wilco and the, the cinema will be here. I think it's three screens that's going to be here. But you've got a crane over there. I'll just pop it through this keyhole. Got a crane over there. Um, but it doesn't look, look like there's much been going on. Just take a walk around here. Yeah, that's the back of the um, Olympia. Um, that fun I was at, just at the back of there for Comic Con. If you're not seen the Comic Con video, I'll, I'll link it, but um, in the top section for you. But yeah, you can just just about to see a crane now with the tower in the background. But it doesn't look like, that, look like there's been much progress since I was here last. So yeah, I shall catch you. Yeah, it's starting to get a bit busy down here. It's not. That it's not as busy as it is on like a weekend. Oh, by the way, uh, Winter Gardens is behind me. Um, I remember going going in the entrance for Comic Con um, as well. It smells a bit of weed. It doesn't smell very nice. Yeah, here we go. 
so we're just gonna make our way towards make our way towards where am I going? Where am I going? Where am I going? Back Bank A Street, there we go. That's the thing then. Christ. So we've got spec savers here. I do actually need some spec savers here because I've just sold my glasses over. And this is my favourite um Hound Hill or shopping centre. I was just in uh yesterday, I think it was. Yesterday. But it is so so quiet. Like for a Thursday evening, this is this is as quiet as it gets. But I'm just so glad to be out filming again because you know I'd I'd been ill for that full week. Um, you got a cafe near over there as well, Vision Express. Um, next to the body shop, um, the Disney store was there, but it's now X Catalog. Uh, who remembers the Disney store being in that building next to the body shop? But yeah, it was quite. Um, quite a nice day that Comic Con. I remember it walking down here and it's packed that weekend and I did go into the entrance down there to go into Comic Con so yeah. Great great day. This is where Bonnet Street Market was but they've moved now into that smaller smaller building. those kids that kids are there again but I'm down Bank Hay Street at the moment I'm not gonna go past Primark because um, those pesky kids are there again but here's Boots there's a comedy club um, I know one of my subscribers um, Joanne bit, bit of a shout out to you there she actually goes to this comedy club um, they've actually put a new sign on Boots as well just another quick pan around. I'm just stood up as just right outside Harry Hamsons at the moment. I don't know what on earth those kids are up to. Yeah, that's her ha Harry Ramsons. So we'll, we'll just go down and sod it. I don't know where that music is coming from. and stuff inside uh, HMV so we're just going to carry on walking there's the, uh, there's the top of the tower as well I need to get myself to the top of that tower um, oh I forgot to show you the hole in one we'll go down there now but that's the the tower there all, all like lit up and then obviously there's um, like little tower dungeons as well so yeah, I really need to have myself up to the bottom at some point. HMV. Fun fact, that's why I have a Geordie CD from. I don't know what was going on down there, but I think that um, I think that guy was doing a bit of a disco. Don't know what's going on down there, but there's a the tower. God, what a thumbnail! It's a little bit quiet, but up this end then it is up that end. But um, there's the new uh, hole in wand. It's proper crazy golf. Um, you got the displays in here, I think. So when you actually complete the course, you do actually get one of these potions, which I think is awesome. There's me in the reflection. Some girls coming. I think they're on a night out. So it's a hole in wand here in Blackpool. I'm gonna go. Which way am I gonna go? I'm gonna go this way. So yes, it's, it's, it's a lot. Um, it's a lot quieter than it is up there. God knows what he was doing. I think he was having a bit of a party of his own. Don't blame him to be honest. <laughs> but yeah, there's another mooch around here. 
this is because this is, all this is just basically part of the town centre anyway. Got a better thread. I need to get myself a McDonald's hot drink. So B and M. I think it's actually still open, I think. We'll go down uh, Church Street, shall we? Go on a walk down there. Okay folks, so we are, uh, we are at St John's Square at the moment. Um, I decided not to film down Church Street because there were some homeless people there. They may, they may have like shouted me or something. So we're going to have a look at the conference centre down there as well actually, just whilst we're here. But there's the Winds Gardens. One of my favourite buildings in Blackpool. And also the fountains are on as well. There's the Vinciro Lounge. Um, up with the West Coast Rock um, Cafe over there as well. But we'll go and have a look at the, um, what to call it first, conference centre. God, it's so nice and quiet down here. Town is, uh, town's busy. But this is the Winter Gardens Co uh, Conference Centre. I nearly said, I nearly said this is the Winter Gardens Coffee Centre. Then I was like, oof. Everyone rushed at Coffee Centre. <laughs> but, um, this, yeah, this is the back of the Winter Gardens. It is a quite nice building, to be quite honest with you, because I have actually seen videos of it, of inside of here. But, yeah, look at that. We're carrying walking around here actually. Because I've not been this way for a while. I don't know. So we thought we're walking towards the that's a nice building. I've not been down here for ages because we do have some of the small hotels and stuff around here. I think I think this is um a club or something in here. I know I know this is the entrance to the ballroom. Uh, this entrance here. We'll go, we'll go around on a block now. This is going to be one fun video to edit, it's really nice. It's better like a walking tour of Blackpool. I think that's what I'll rename it. But yeah, I think that's, that's the, this is the, oh, this is the entrance to the ballroom. Um, just hope nobody's around here. Oh, it's so quiet. Oh, yes. What absolute bliss. But yeah, this is the side of the Winter Gardens. We're heading up towards the back of the Hounds Hill. Whether they in the extension. To be quite honest with you, I thought they were going to be knocking down that multi story car park at the back, but they're actually not. They're keeping that, and the extension is going to be just built in front of, do you know, where the small car park used to be? Um, yeah, just where the small car park used to be at the back of the house, I had to think that. That's why it's so busy. It's street art as well. Blackpool for you though, wasn't it? I mean, it's not even a Saturday night. It? it doesn't feel that busy, to be quite honest with you. But it's just one of those nights. I think what I've got is going out to that front. You've got some of the... I think these are actually independent hotels. So they're run by um, people who actually own them. And stuff, well, you know what I mean. Independent people who... Yeah, you know what I mean. I had to think then, but this is the back of the Winter Garden. We've just come out to the Olymp Olympia now. It's quite a nice building, to be quite honest with you, because that's why it's one of my favourite buildings in Blackpool. So, yeah. So the next time you see me will be when I have a McDonald's hot chocolate in my hand and we are at the Tower Festival Headland. Gosh. And we are back. The Hound Hill extension with the sun coming through. So we'll see you folks um, a little bit later on. I'm going to scoot down here now towards McDonald's. I should know about Blackpool by now. It's probably because I've not been here for like a good couple of weeks. No new trips then. So I shall catch you folks at uh, the Tar Festival Headland. By the way, it's not all blocked off anymore. I think there was an, an event on there, so 
yeah, I'll see you folks down there. Okay, folks, so I've got my hot chocolate. Um, those kids, those two kids passed me again. I don't know what their game is tonight, but they're, they're causing mischief. So I actually have no idea what they're doing. Problems on that. I'm just going to sit, sit and drink this. Catch the sunset. I think it's just going down. Look at that. I've got to take a picture of this. Give me one sec. Yeah, I don't know what their game is tonight. Um, that's four times they've called me downtown now. Um, I'm just at the tower here. They're just going around asking people for money, which is just stupid. Um, excuse me, I've got a quid, I've got a quid. No, no, we haven't. And if we had, I wouldn't give it to you. Because I'm, I'll know what it's going to go towards anyway. So, yeah. It's quite a nice sunset, actually. I do need to sit down a bit and rest my poor old legs. So I'm gonna do that do that now, I'll face this way actually look, get, a, look, get a bit of light in. I'm gonna do that now and then um we'll have one last sort of look around the comedy carpet as well. Uh, just so I'm here. But um it's been good, it's been good. It's 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 nice to get out again and just just, just film stuff like this for you folks and it feels like my channel has been sort of dead. Not many block of vlogs, but you know, now I can start getting out a bit more now. The weather's starting to get a bit nicer, and um, hopefully there's no more, no more storms as well. Because I think it was a few days ago um, the UK actually was battered with a storm as well, which which wasn't very really good. But yeah, hopefully the, these videos will sort of certainly pick my channel up as well, because. Um, you know, it's my channel and I want to sort of continue doing outdoor things like this. So the moon is out. This this hot chocolate by the way is like really really nice and thick. So I'm gonna drink this, have a bit of rest, and I'm gonna go on a, a wander around the top of Wolf Headland. Um, there is a couple of people on the beach as well. But um yeah, I'm gonna drink this and then I shall go. <laughs> Dirty little bees, bees, bees. Don't swear, don't swear with YouTube. Freak's sake. I've got these freaking wash now. These seagulls are absolute menace to society, I tell you that right now. So, um, there's actually people at the top of the tower. I've just been sat on the bench there and there's actually people at the top. I can't believe that seagull but he took a bloody crap on me. How disgusting. I'm just going to walk over to this bin and then put chocolate away and then we'll just have a, a quick pan just hope those two kids don't call me on the bus uh, on the bus on the on the way to get the bus because i'm going to walk down there towards the winter gardens to get the bus um at 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 outside the council offices mm -hmm. that was a nice hot chocolate i like it it's nice and thin not like when it's like watery and stuff but yeah um i'm at the tower festival headland at the moment the sun is just about to set oh wow that sunset i just took a photo of that um the zip what you call it uh, uh, on the uh, oh because it just going from what i'm what i'm saying tonight at the north pier that's what i was on about now. but yeah i think there's actually people at the top of the tower well there is actually because i can i can, I can see them there, but there's a lot of there's a lot of banging and stuff going on. I don't know what they're doing, but there was quite a bit of banging and stuff going on. But wasn't that sunset? From here, and um, I just wanted to walk over here actually towards the Viva Vegas Park. Because if you if you folks know and if you folks know Blackpool well. There is a camera at the top of the Vegas bar, which actually it actually overlooks the whole comedy carpet area. 
and I do sometimes watch that from home, especially if I can't get to back pool or I'm just not feeling energetic enough to, you know, film um, a black pool with a video. But I'm so glad I took the opportunity to film these tonight for you because I like, I love editing. Um, it, it 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 makes me like creative and stuff, and I just I just like being a YouTuber and a YouTube creator. And obviously, you folks have helped me so much with the support and encouragement and the comments and the likes and the subscribers and stuff like that. But I'm gonna stop rambling because I don't know if you can see. If we just zoom in a sec, where well, that seagull just, just seagull just flown off, you can just about see the the, the camera that overlooks this. Um, that overlooks the camera carpet as well. But that's my favourite seat there. That looks so good. But I'm gonna have a walk over here and we'll get the view from the other side, shall we? the view from if I was watching the live on the show, uh, which was one of my favourites last year and I'm so looking forward to being back again this year. I feel like I've filmed quite a bit which is just awesome. Um, it's going to be certainly challenging. Um, <laughs> there's, there's an event on at the, at the tower ballroom. The lights are on in the ballroom. Yeah, I'm gonna sort of box this video off, video off here because I need to get myself home. Um, but yeah, this is the view as if I was watching the latest show. I think it's a little up actually. I don't actually. But yeah, I just want to say thank you so much for watching any of these videos. Um, I'm gonna get off home because it's starting to get a little bit nippy and the sun is just going down as well as we speak. So um, yeah, thank you so much for following me along on these this two-part video i also do a three-part um it may it may end up being a three-part video i'm not too sure but i'll probably do like a big two-part video um sort of i can focus on the energy and stuff on that two-part video and stuff then but the tower lights are just coming on and blackpool will be livening up as soon as it gets uh, as soon as it gets dark so i'm gonna head off home now go down there for my bus and um yeah, I just want to say thanks so much for watching these, for watching these videos, and I hope those two kids don't call me when I'm walking for the bus home. It looks fairly quiet down there, so thanks for watching, for watching again, and I shall see you folks um, in my next video. Take care, and yeah, thanks for watching.